Yeah, don't lose. Hello? <laughs> don't lose. <laughs> Much louder. These are nice. What do we do with this? I, I would. I would go it's, without. In case you come across no. a stubborn bolt. Yeah, there ain't no stubborn bolts. I got that. I just saw smoke. It was like the weirdest thing in the world. That was wild, dude. So they didn't, bro. Okay, That's well, like well I'm demonetized again because you keep, you f***ing keep f***ing cussing. Stop f***ing cussing. The f and f***ing. What do you think? You got him? We'll see what he does. Is this going to happen? He wants to. If that pickup truck changes lanes, he's going to take off. Yeah, don't lose. Hello? <laughs> don't lose. <laughs> Break-in is about to be complete. Time to full send after this. Oh, that's there freaking cool. Time to full send. That's got a nice, that's got a nice little pull to it. That's, that's definitely better than... Better than a 500 horsepower yeah. Mustang. Yeah, that, that's, that feels good. <laughs> What's going on guys and welcome back to the channel here. We go finally we got my Jeremy's C8 We've yeah. had a few days with it such a blast finally got the break-in period done But today we're gonna fix something because this car is way too quiet So we're gonna spice things up with a or high flow cat, cat is yeah. what it is Made by a long tube headers. So we're gonna install it. We're gonna have some fun. We're gonna make some noise It's gonna be a fun video guys first mod on Jeremy's new C8. Let's get this thing fired up. We're gonna move some cars around get this thing in the garage Start the install make some noise. Let's go And a Raptor links up above click up there click that card uh, He's done some modifications to this thing. It's really cool. You don't want to miss it, but definitely check out his channel guys Much louder. Tell me in the comments what's your favorite? Mustang, Corvette. Mustang, Corvette. Let me know. Loud? Way too quiet. Can you rev it? Let's hear it, man. Such a killer car, man. You got room for days, man. You're good. And then I did actually break the record for uh, SCCA time trial nationals, but that got rebroken. Pro driver, right? That record got broken, I think, four times over the weekend. Oh my gosh. Yeah, but we still have the fastest Mustang ever around that track. So. That's that's crazy. But, I mean, we left the cage in there, and I'm gonna leave that in there. I might get it painted to match the, the seats here. Even the red doesn't look bad, though. Honestly, we have we have three grown adults. You know what I mean? Like. We're not gonna mess this up, are we? None of us really know what we're doing. But <laughs> we're gonna try to circus our way around this. What do we got here? So much crap around the garage from... I know, man, you got parts everywhere. But this is what we're doing. So, made by Long Tube Header. And it is a 200 cell high flow cat that is supposed to wake this bad boy up in both horsepower and noise. I tell you what, I love the finish of these, man. They look really good. These are nice. All right, so what are we doing? We're taking all this stuff apart, right? Yes. So Torx bits, cats right there and there. Those ginormous things are what we're going to replace. Do not throw a check engine light and no tune required. Ah, sweet. More horsepower, more sound, no disadvantages to doing this. No. So we'd be able to compliant, so he says, I guess, uh, yeah. <laughs> this looks like a mess, man. See, that's what I'm looking at. I'm looking this, at all these stuff. This stuff. Oh. Yes, do we have to take the uh, this weather lining out too? Yeah, I don't think so. Because I've never tugged on plastic pieces on a no. Corvette. I don't want to break nothing, you know what I mean? No. So we've got some it's torque bits everywhere. I'm more curious about them. These probably just turn out. Yep, they do. We definitely need to wrap up the fenders yeah. back here. The front of the engine, the accessories, the belts, the pulleys are tucked up there. And there is no room. If you had to do like engine work on this, I don't even know what, how you would do that. Do it from the bottom. You got to drop out of the bottom, but you got to disassemble the entire car. You know, mid-engine car problems, but... They say you can drop the entire drivetrain in an hour. Really? Uh 
and and the out. thing just comes out. Wow. So where do we put these? Oh, here. Highlighter yellow. They call it accelerate yellow. Corvette. Yeah, we can do that. So what's next for the R? It's gonna get like crazy real quick. Really? To be honest with you, I was always thinking twin turbo, but with my experience with the GT500, yeah, I think a Whipple might like work because if it can cool, if you can cool it, yeah, that you but, know what but I mean. See, for time attack, I really only need one lap, one and then you can lap, you can let it cool down. Yeah, exactly. I'm a big twin turbo guy. You guys obviously know that. I and think twin turbos because I can mount the weight lower, you know, in the right. chassis. Right. The sleeper kick. Out. So hell horse performance kit maybe twin turbo kits. From Hell Horse Performance, same one that I've got in my car, have been revised considerably. New four to one headers are standard in the kit, something I don't even have yet. And the cold side piping all over the kit is changing. You won't get the kit that I've got, you will actually get something better. And oh, by the way, don't pay full price. Use promo code Xander. 13 at hellhorseperformance.com save you a bunch of money. Fuel systems, we use the Lethal Performance return style fuel system on my car and it works beautifully. I love it. Xander13 is also the promo code there and all of us, me and Steve here both are big fans of BMR suspension. That's why I run on my car. Same with him. He tracks it. It works well. I use mine on the drag strip. Promo code Xander7 at checkout at bmrsuspension.com. Go and try your luck. Me and again, we let it rain. Please don't start us up. Got that black and white, that yin and yang. Mr. Officer, please don't search us. We don't got a thing. Tell her, park it up. Then that ass be poking up them jeans. All this is going to come off and it's going to expose the backside of the catalytic converters, give us access. T15, I think is what it is. T15? I don't know what I'm doing, but for some reason it's fun. Cool. We're about to uncover the air intake. There we go. Got Jeremy on the camera. <laughs> You're fired. I'm sure I am. What am I trying to say? We're going to add some f fluid to make it shift better yeah what do we do with this oh this is the intake oh no that is this is the intake we have to take this out uh what do you mean we just kidding <laughs> give this video a thumbs up or down but we encourage a thumbs up i appreciate it thank you 10 mil bolts you got four of them on each side and all it does is same over here removed and it just simply there it goes it just comes out like that yep there's a shot of it right there cool um now what do we do from here there's plugs all over this okay so we're gonna throttle body yeah but it feels secure back here so we'll just explore when we figure it out we'll let you know the whole reason for me buying the 500 i already had this guys are still here. arguing i wanted a powerhouse you know what i'm saying like, this I'm car gonna... versus the 500 out there dude this is the most well, stubborn clip i've ever seen in my life i know man that's why i have you doing it not me <laughs> but I will say, yeah, this car with like 750 horse, nasty, dude. Just nasty. But the problem is, you can't tune them. That's, why That's where we're at right now Z06 today. To no, yeah, I know. You will be able to. Next the year, I agree. if there's a tune in this, I'm not going to tune mine. Hell no. Not this is what we're doing tonight. <laughs> putting it back together. No. I would totally build this thing. Like a thousand horsepower. I, would, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know if I'd go that far. Right? I, I would. I would go it's without. Simply because I'll never use it. I I'm would. not a hardcore track guy like you. I'll do track for fun. I, I would use it. 100%. Steve, thoughts? <laughs> and, 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 <laughs> How much power? Want, what do you want out of the car? Ow. For Care, me, careful. if I'm at a stoplight, so yeah. 99% of the cars that line up to next to me in the stop, there's one on this side. Oh my god. Your turn. Uh, I'm holding the camera. <laughs> nope. Yep, Just one pull of really hard. Plugs, yeah. plugs, plugs, plugs. Right. Yeah, get, getting this thing out is a nightmare. Yeah, All right. it has a little red tab. No, but he was just sitting on this. You have to push behind the red tab, then it comes out. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Just Hold cut it with scissors. Pull. Just snappy, snappy, bro. Do it. Break that shit. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Don't really break it. Going from the side. Hang on, let me see it. Yeah, there you go. You're good. What, what you have to deal with is uh, a bunch of plugs, right? And a bunch of Christmas trees everywhere. Just take your time. You will need a flashlight, I promise right. you. Now, what fill we plug. have is, yeah, there's your fill plug. So yellow right there. And you can see now, excuse me, we have exposed catalytic converters. Pretty easy to get to at this point. Bolts on both sides, top and bottom. So... Alrighty, man. We're making some progress. Yeah, 16 to 17 pounds. Wow. Those are six? 
Those are six yeah. each. Each. Yeah. yeah, it's a bit of weight savings. It's obviously different than yeah, this one. We're getting the problem bolt down here, the bottom. This is like a triangle flange, so it's a pain in the butt. But to get the, uh, you got to get the heat shielding out. The way you do this is you get rid of that bar, this strut tower brace. Um, you'll take this, the, the bolts out and you'll slap it towards the engine up here and then the whole thing comes out. You got a Christmas tree right here that goes into the bottom. You said that these are 1300 bucks. 1350. 1350 for cats. The only cheaper option was like China. Well, but I guess so you said you got to pay that. You just said you got to pay that Corvette tax. Well, I mean, sole performance which people have used, those are $2700. It's a lot of money, dude. Yes, they do. $800 for test pipes for cat delete. Are you kidding me? I bet they perform pretty well though. I bet they give you a lot of horsepower. Is we have the LTH uh, high flow cats there mounted there and there looks really good a little bit of weight savings 20 horsepower difference Maybe everything is perfect with the kit the fitment and alignment of everything is absolutely spot-on This is my first time dealing with this company and I mean it's just perfect. It honestly is We're gonna add two extra quarts of diff fluid now put it all back together finish up with by now will be a cold start with the new exhaust mod. Key takeaways from this kit is, this is my first time dealing with a C8 and let alone modding one. So took us about four hours. Just allow yourself some extra time in case you come up. Yeah. In case you come across no. a stubborn bolt. Yeah, there ain't no stubborn bolts. I got that <laughs> Ain't no stubborn bolt gonna defeat me. Guys, redoing all that. Okay, key take, yeah. But now, now, well, in about two seconds, we got to put it back together. Will be the cold start. Let's go. I just saw smoke. It was like the weirdest thing in the world. No, I saw like smoke, like it just like, like a ghost. That was wild, dude. It's in the open. If you can't find nothing, it's in the open. 100% all day long, twice on Sunday. It's lost. It's gone forever. Bye bye. <laughs>
just bit. just a little bit. And that crack, crack. I shit. like it. I do like it. Yes. Mm-hmm. <laughs>